Hey guys, welcome back to Geek News. I am your host, I am Adam, and we've got a few things to talk about today. We're going to be taking a look at the tickets for the PowerCon 2022 that's going to be in Ohio this year. Uh, it's pretty cool, so they're going on sale here, and we'll look at that in a moment. And we're also going to look at some Mega Constructs, because you know what? I've never looked at Mega Constructs yet. I've seen them in the stores, I've seen them in the mall, but I never actually really looked in depth at them. So we're going to check out some new ones and probably some old ones as well. So let's go ahead and cover this new stuff first and see what we got going on. So PowerCon 2022 ticket sales and exclusive update. Uh, PowerCon 22 ticket sales go up on April 9th, 2022, so I'm wondering if you guys are going to be going, let me know. Uh, the former Masters of the Universe Heavy Con will now feature an expanded focus on other toy lines. For the last decade, PowerCon has been the home of yearly Masters of the Universe fan convention and a move to expand the other toy lands. Toy lines, I should say, not lands. PowerCon is evolving along with the change of venue from Anaheim, California to Columbus, I, Ohio. So that's cool. It's going to be there this year. And that's also going to be, let me see here. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's not the right page. So PowerCon this year is going to be August 5th to August 7th. That's going to be the date. I'm not going to attend. However, I am going to be covering the news. So in the moment there's some footage or some photos of some stuff showing up there, you can bet that we are going to cover it here on this channel. And that covers basically that. So yeah, you guys let me know. Are you guys going to go to PowerCon this year? Because that's pretty cool. Or are you guys going to be uh, just checking out? And if, you, if, you, if you're not going to go and you just want to tune into it, just you know tune in onto this channel because I'm going to be covering it. So let's move on over to the um, Mega Constructs. Now this is uh, courtesy of Toy Habits for these footages and, or these uh, photos and stuff. So we've got... Um, Mega Construct sets in stock, in stock on Target, Amazon, Walmart, and eBay. Find figures to complete your Masters of the Universe collection. So this is kind of cool. Now, I've never looked at any of these. So this is kind of neat. We got a Beast Man going on here. So these are single carded ones. So we got a Beast Man. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen this one in the store. I think I might have seen this Evil in. So we got the standard Evil in. Um, basically the skin color version and then we've got that other one evil in they're calling this one the 2000 and x i guess and we've got a faker so that's kind of cool uh we've got a fisto going on down here it looks kind of cool these images are kind of small though uh we got a man at arms i've definitely never seen this one i might have seen a fisto i'm not sure i can't remember um i definitely didn't see man at arms because this is actually kind of neat i don't i haven't collected any of these but uh it doesn't mean i don't like them i think they're pretty cool uh moss man so he looks kind of cool there and it does they do come with their own little set of accessories too so we got a prince adam he's looking pretty good i do like the way they look so we got a mini comic uh roboto so he's got that you know that older style kind of going on we got Scareglow, we got a skeletor uh we got stinkor of course stinkor is my favorite so that's cool stratos tila that trap jaw is so cool i don't know what it is with trap jaw but every time they make a trap jaw figure he just looks so cool i just i love every incarnation that they've done with him uh triclops here looks pretty good this is obviously based off your um uh mini comic triclops there uh, carded figure set so we got a he-man and a beast man set so that's kind of cool now i've seen this one for sure this is that flock panthor one with with uh skeletor uh battle for eternity so we got uh faker beast man he-man skeletor and tila so that's kind of cool hero five pack you know we've got our trap jaw uh triclops manny faces roboto and scareglow and I never really got into the Skeletor skull building sets. I guess these go with the uh, Mega Constructs. If I'm not mistaken, these open up. I've seen these, these down in Toys R Us multiple different times. I've just never really took too much attention to them. And Zombie He-Man Slime Pit. Now, this is what piqued my eye because I like the Slime, uh, slime. I like the slime Pit quite a bit. 
I really hope that that comes out in the Origins line. I am just waiting for it. I'm just going to be so happy to finally get a cool slime toy. And this is actually looking pretty good. So you got the uh, zombie He-Man going on there where he's all covered in slime. So that's kind of cool. And we got construct construction sets, of course, the Battle Cat. Battle Cat and Roton, uh, Battle Ram. Oh, uh, there's like, look at that, Battle Bones SDCC exclusive. So San Diego, San Diego Comic Con exclusive. Boo, I hate exclusive stuff, but hey, that looks really cool. A land shark, so that's cool for the land shark fans. Panthor and Point Dread. And now it has Skeletor going on in the package. Does that mean you get him too? Because it shows him and it's got like, you know, um, uh, who am I thinking here? I want to say Stratos, but it's not Stratos. It's, uh, d d d it's on the tip of my tongue. I'm having a brain freeze right now. Sodak, there we go. Uh, we got a She-Ra and Hordak and Monstroid, so that's cool. I like this pack, you know, getting a Hordak and a She-Ra. If I was to start collecting these things, this is the one that I would want, just because I like Hordak and She-Ra quite a bit. Uh, we got a Wind Raider. And, of course, the Castle Grayskull. Now, I want to click on one of these, specifically the Slime Pit one, um, just to see if we get any bigger uh, photos. Let's click on the Walmart one. Yeah, so here we go. This is cooler. We get a little bit bigger photos going on here. We can actually look at these. So this is $29.99 at Wally World, aka Walmart. Uh, yeah, so that's cool. So there's a little slime going down. Now, obviously, it's not going to have real slime to play with it, but it's kind of cool. I like this. This is kind of neat. Oh, yeah, and you get all kinds of cool. There we go. Now we get some details up here, and it looks like he's translucent plastic. I see, and it comes in like you build it. It comes in a skull. Okay, I'm getting what's going on here. I was going to say, this looks like Skeletor's skull. I never really paid much attention to these, and I really should. Let me try another new one here, just to see what we got going on here. Let's, let's, see, let's take a look at the uh, trap jaw. I want to see him, if it lets me. Oh, I see. It's only like it's only available Amazon and eBay, I guess. Whatever one's highlighted in red, but at least we get a better yeah, we get a little bit better of a close up photo of Trap Jaw here and this just I don't know, this looks really cool. I like it. So friggin' cool guys. I don't know, do you guys collect these mega constructs? I've never collected them, but the way that I see them and if they're I mean they're only twelve ninety nine, I assume that's probably USA B, so that's pretty probably going to be 14 to 19.99 in canada next time i go to toys R Us, i will check the prices on them i will actually specifically look for them because i never really specifically looked for them before just because i'm curious on how much they cost if i can find characters like this i would probably start collecting them at that price point I do love masters of the universe so where's that monstroid one i want to see that shira here we go, we got Walmart. See if we can get some bigger photos going on here. Something I can look at. And they're not really showing anything too close up. That's about as close as we're going to get. Unless we can get a close up on the Amazon one. Let's try this one. Here we go, that's a little better. I can kind of use my zoom in tool oh there she is look at that that was freaking cool man oh i like it i like it i like it it's your prince adam and frig even the hordak looks cool he's all shiny monstroid looks cool so how does he get built does he he doesn't come in a skull obviously he just probably comes loose in a bunch of pieces in a bag inside the box, probably. So yeah, that's kind of cool. Like, some of these Mega Constructs are actually kind of cool. Actually, I forgot to check the price point on that one. $29.99 or $97, so yeah, that's probably USA price. Which means they're probably $49.99 here in Canada. Don't quote me on that yet, because I haven't, uh, I'll have to check the prices. Uh, of course, the Battle Bones, you're only going to get it on eBay. And it's probably a pre-order more than likely 
Wow, look at that. $4.79, folks. And 50 cents plus $23 and $71 in shipping now. Keep in mind, this is going to be the Canadian fee. So in the US, it'll probably be closer to half of that. So when you're seeing $4.79, that does not mean USA. Or actually, maybe it does. Yes, it is. Sorry, that is USA. It's $5.99 Canadian. So wow. Craziness. Oh, look at that. Faker, Tila, Mossman. Oh, man. Do you get these characters with it or do you just get the battle bones? Man, this is so friggin' cool. Uh, do I really want to start collecting another line like this? Like, oh, man. My poor, poor wallet. It must be 20 accessories it comes with, so it must come with these characters. That's so cool. That's why it's so freaking expensive. Anywho, guys, that's enough of that stuff for today. I just kind of wanted to go over a little bit of constructs because I've never really done it before. And I am going to check them out when I get down to the store. But yeah, this video has been on long enough. Anyways, let me know what you guys are thinking about that Comic-Con. Are you excited to at least watch it? I know last year's was pretty good, so uh, hopefully this year's will be really good. But yeah, we'll see you guys on the next video. You guys have a good one, and I'm out for today. And uh, until next time, take care and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.